Hello there, Controversy Seekers. It's good to see you all here again. This is your regular dose of raw news and analysis. Today, let's talk about the sensational night that Prince Harry and Meghan Markle had at Beyonce's epic Renaissance World Tour concert. It was an event that's got everyone talking, and the dynamics between the two roles were, well, quite something. But whoa, slow your roll before you pick up the pace. Become an official member of the squad. Subscribe and ring the bell. So picture this, the world-famous SoFi Stadium in Inglewood was the stage for an electrifying Beyoncé performance. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex were in attendance, and it was a night that had the world talking. But here's where the plot thickens. Meghan Markle and her mother Doria were living their best lives at the concert. They were seen dancing and waving, immersing themselves in the music and the pulsating energy of the crowd. It was a mother-daughter bonding moment, a celebration of music's power to bring joy. But what about Harry? Well, here's the thing where it gets juicy. Observers keenly noted that Harry appeared appeared more reserved. In fact, he was frequently checking his phone, leading to some suggestions that he looked disinterested. Could this be a sign of trouble in paradise? Rumours are swirling. There's speculation about Harry's possible divorce with Meghan on the horizon. Some are even suggesting that Prince Harry is fed up and frustrated with the disgusting and evil Meghan. They claim that Meghan only cares about the spotlight and fame with little regard for Harry and the royal family. Now let's step back and analyse the situation. We're all human and we all have moments where we might not be as engaged as we should. Harry checking his phone doesn't mean that it spells doom. After all, we've all been there scrolling through messages or emails during an event. It doesn't automatically mean he's miserable on the verge of divorce. What do you guys think about the news? Let us know in the comments and we'll see you next time for more raw news and analysis.